Okay, this is a video instruction for requisition of ENC cells for your Tokyo Quakey ECDIS. First off, you have to open your nav station. Okay, then go to root planning. You can either edit an existing root or you could add a new one. For example, click new, then input the name, then you'll just have to start on left clicking your root. After that, you will have to click save. Then. Click back, you can find your root on the root list which is alphabetically ordered. So this was the root that we made with the root name root1. Okay so after doing or making your root. You can export this root, this one, in an external flash drive or uh, on the desktop and upload it or import it in the nav tracker. The nav tracker is this one. This is the main program for ENC requisition. And for your information, if you make a requisition of ENC cells under the root, the permits or license for your ADP will also be included for that area. Later on, you will receive via email the new license key to be installed in your ADP, which, is, which will be discussed in another video. So either way, you can export Okay, so the root will have a file extension of .csv You can either save it on the desktop or any other external memory Then save Okay, minimize, go to nav tracker, click roots, import. Look for the root file which is root1.csv. Then open. One root has been imported successfully. Click OK. You can see there's a red exclamation point. It says that this is a newly imported root. To complete the import, it has to be synchronized with the server. So the server is automatically updated every week, uh, specifically on Saturdays during weekly update for ENC. You can either do this uh, importation of importing of the root or you could wait for the weekly synchronization of nav tracker and nav the nav station if you make a new root in nav station and a weekend has passed 
it will be automatically seen in this nav tracker you can confirm that it was successfully imported after synchronization if there is no exclamation point after that you could click on the root then you could successfully see it in the nav tracker otherwise if it's a new root and it's not synchronized yet you can't activate it here then after that you could send you could send a requisition via email to our uh, superintendent This is only applicable here on our vessel because we don't have any internet. Uh, our requisition of ENC cells will be processed through email. Okay, so we're back in making the requisition request. Ah, sorry, <laughs> it was redundant. It was, I mean, the requisition message for our superintendent. So I have an example here. Requisition like this one. This was the previously made requisition. It you could just make a simple email for the superintendent. So as of here, good day, route voyage twenty three, Singapore to Chiba imported in Navy Tracker as requested for ordering of ENC cells I made this one because our superintendent was asking before to import the route and this was my response or the previously sent may we humbly request the purchasing of all ENC cells under the new imported route in our nav tracker titled Voyage 21, Kalau to Landunggang, WNIS, our destination was suddenly changed. Thank you very much. Then you'll just have to tell the captain or master that you have a pending message for the superintendent. The superintendent will then place the request to nav door and to confirm that you have received your ENC cells you will have to go back to nav tracker as for this one the previously imported one I will delete it so delete okay the last one that I requested yesterday was this one Balboa to Nola which are New Orleans, Louisiana. So I activated the route. You could either activate it or not, it's up to you. And just click on the products. Here you can see that the green cells under the route that I needed is already provided. So our new ENC cells are available for uh, for exporting and for installing in our like this. Okay. Just in case some of the ENC cells that you need is missing because sometimes our superintendent is trying to remove some of the ENC cells under the root uh, which is to him or or is unnecessary for the next voyage you can re-request it if it's less than 10 cells you can request it by message for example a 
additional ENC request like this one may we humbly request the purchasing of all uh, of additional ENC cells is listed below for our new diverted route as per WMI advisory due to onset heavy weather thank you very much then you'll just have to list down the ENC names after receiving this one that's the time when you can export it uh, to double check the green cells are the valid you can click here on the lower right part you can also show the not listed which you don't have the cells that you don't have and as for me for my current route this is good enough okay if you receive this one then you're good to go you will just have to export uh, uh, your newly received ENC cells in your flash drive and mind you you will only use you should only use for actis only the, the provided flash drive for like this you shouldn't use any other flash drive because it may it may cause a virus infection in your egg dish so that's all for ordering of ENC cells